Hey everyone, it's me Curtis. Welcome to my channel or welcome back if you're a returning subscriber. By the title of today's video, you guys already know that today I'm going to be doing a Christmas themed small pet giveaway. Yes, obviously I think it's a great time to give back because it is the holiday season, which is the season of giving and for a lot of people it is their favorite season as well. But I also thought it would be a really good way for me to just reintroduce myself here on my channel, obviously since I have not posted in a few months. Before we get started, I just wanted to clarify that yes, this is really not the first video I wanted to post back, but it is a timely video since it is Christmas themed, and hopefully I will have a video coming up with like updates about the pets and all that other kind of stuff coming up soon. we jump into the video I just wanted to say that if you are not even planning on joining the giveaway there is going to be something for everyone watching this video so just make sure you continue watching throughout in order to find out what that is so if you did not know um, I do run an Etsy shop where you know I sell a bunch of pet supplies for all different kinds of animals and recently especially for the time that I have been off of YouTube I've been really expanding and creating new items creating new variations of my items and a lot of my items have been doing very very well or I should just say my shop in general Needless to say, that's where a lot of my time has gone into. Obviously, yes, I'm still a full-time college student on top of everything else. But, you know, if when I'm not doing that, I'm usually just doing things related to my shop, sending out orders, responding to customers, and all things related. And recently, within the last few weeks, I actually did a Christmas collection, where which I uh, launched recently. I don't even remember how to talk. I actually tried this out for Halloween and it did not go well because I posted everything maybe like two days before Halloween and it was so bad. The items that I released in this Christmas collection are not necessarily new items, but they are new variations, new colors, new patterns of the items that um, you guys already know and love. And also these items will not be continued after the holiday season, so they're just going to be retired. Now is the only time that you're going to be able to get these on my shop. Needless to say, there are a few items within the whole entire collection and uh, I do offer a Christmas bundle which comes with all of the items. There are two different kind of bundles, one that comes with the more gradient style hammocks and then one that comes with the red hammocks with the green trim and the winner of this giveaway is going to be able to choose which of the two they want. So for the bundle that uh, the winner of this giveaway will be getting, you will be getting a foraging dish, two hammocks, um, the triangle hammock which is actually a newer design of mine as well as a uh, snuggle sack of course. So if you want the actual really clean listing photos and all that kind of stuff, you can of course click the link in the description of today's video to visit my Etsy shop where you'll get all that information, all the specific product dimensions, how to use them, all that kind of stuff. But I will quickly just run through some of the items. So this is the peppermint foraging dish. This is actually a like bestseller on my shop. People love the foraging dishes. Obviously the peppermint one with the green paw prints is one that is just for uh, you know limited time. It will not be around forever. As I said, after the holiday season, this will no longer be for sale. But this is what the dish looks like, and I actually engraved one of these for somebody recently as well. So, that's this. Before I continue, um, I just wanted to show you guys my dog, Mason. Of course, a lot of you guys have seen him in my videos. He's probably not going to be super happy to just sit here the whole time, because, you know, he's upright. But I just wanted to show you guys what he's wearing. This is another one of his new Christmas outfits, of course. Um, this is butt, but I don't know if you guys can see what that says, but it says naughty. His little, um, Christmas gear on. <laughs> I'm going to put him down now because he's probably tired of me. Um, alright, so the next two square hammocks that I have that are new is, firstly, this one right here, which is the gradient pattern that I was talking about. Um, I really like this one because, for some reason, like, the yarn I obviously use and the pattern that I, um, created for this, kind of like makes like these inverse stripe things going on here. It's the same dimension, same pattern as all my other things. It's really great for mice especially and other small animals of course. And then I also have this one which is probably my favorite item in the whole thing that I've made. And I plan on actually making more with a uh, trim like this but probably see that a little bit better now. Uh, I never made a hammock with a border before like this but as you guys can see it looks really 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 good especially in Christmas themed cages. Sorry that I'm like getting back into focus now. Um, Alright, yeah, it looks better back there, but this is what this one looks like. And of course, to go with both of the last two hammocks that I showed you guys, I have the matching triangle hammocks, which, as I mentioned earlier, is a newer pattern of mine. My pet mice, this is their one of their favorite items. Not this variation specifically, but just this hammock style and design. Like I said, you guys can see photos of my mice and other pets using these if you just visit the, um, my shop, of course. And then I also have the same, I have the red and green one that goes with the last hammock that you guys saw as well and to clarify in the bundle you get you know this set oh, and I, oh. oh I'm not even focused 
And to clarify, in this set, you either get, you know, this bundle here, or this bundle here. Gradient, or the red and green. <laughs> And then the last item that comes in the bundle is, of course, the Snuggle Sack. This is, again, one of my mice's favorite items. I don't tend to put these in their cage, or at least not right on the bedding, because as with any fleece item, um, you know, it's kind of annoying sometimes to get bedding off of it, if I'm being honest. But that's also why I put them on the platforms that I also sell in my shop, like the cage platforms, just to keep them out of the bedding and make them a little bit easier to clean. But what I've moan... Moanly? But what I've been mostly using these for uh, recently is actually just sitting them on my desk for my mice. Uh, I know if you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys will probably see some highlights where I uh, will sit, you know, Lily or my other mice on my desk. And they, these are literally so, so, so soft. I'm not even exaggerating. You know, they will literally just sit in my desk and sit in this. And it's not only this one as well. I obviously have all the other colors as well. And just for all intents and purposes of anybody who's looking into getting any of these items, they can be purchased individually. You just have to visit like the individual listing, like the general listing. And then when you go to variations to select, you'll see the specific Christmas ones in order for you to choose an order. So now another big part of the giveaway, how do you win? Of course, I kind of wanted to obviously do this, like I said, as a give back to just the people who have been supporting me. And that's not to say that if you are just watching this as my first video, you can't win. That's 100% not the case, actually. I kind of wanted the basis off of more than just picking a random name from a generator, you know? Being said, this giveaway is actually gonna be pretty much social media based. However, like I mentioned earlier in the video, stick around because there's gonna be something for everyone, even if you cannot join this specific giveaway. So the first thing that you're gonna do is comment down below in the comment section of today's video what small pet or small pets you have as well as their names if you would like and your Twitter and Instagram handles. If you don't know what your handles are, they're just pretty much your username. You do not need to have both an Instagram and a Twitter account, but if I'm being honest here, if I see your name pop up on multiple social media accounts and see you engaging with this YouTube video, etc., it's going to be more likely that you're going to be able to win because I'm actually going to be looking at you guys' accounts, what animals you have, and all that kind of stuff just to kind of get a better idea as to who's watching my videos and those kinds of things. The next thing that you're going to do is for the people on Instagram, you're going to take this photo which will be on posted on my Instagram by the time this video goes live and you're going to screenshot that and repost it to your account. And now this is the very, very important part. So when you go to Instagram, tag me in the actual photo so when you like see the little black bar with the person's name you can click on it to visit their profile tag me in the photo that way because this is going to be the easiest way for me to just see everybody who has pretty much participated in this giveaway via Instagram and then in the comment section of your photo you can pretty much say whatever you want but the only requirement is that you tag two other small animal pages or people or anything like that and then for Twitter you don't have to make an entire post you can just quote tweet my original tweet which would be on my account of course so you're gonna know which one to quote tweet and then just tag two other small animal people as I mentioned before for Instagram again I apologize if you do not have um, social media but honestly it's one of the easiest ways for me to manage who's entering the giveaway who's doing what they should be doing not be doing those are the rules for entering but the guidelines and restrictions and all that legal kind of stuff will be in the description of today's video so make sure you just check that out before um, submitting any info or completing any of the steps so now more information about the giveaway this giveaway will close on the 15th of December and the winner will be picked and announced on the 16th of December the winner will have 24 hours in order to respond to their congratulations I guess you can call it and if not um, then a new winner will be picked I would have ideally liked to make this giveaway longer and actually have it be done sooner but obviously with time and everything I can't really undo that and at least by these deadlines I can still ship the item out by the 16th or 17th and it will get to the person before Christmas they can have their cages set up and use it in photos and all that kind of stuff for Christmas as well as into the new year because the holidays go on for most people at least a few days into the new year. Best of luck to everyone um, joining this giveaway and just a huge thank you to again everyone who's watching this video and who has supported me either from the beginning or if this is like I said your first video seeing my face. So now for everyone watching this video whether you plan on entering the giveaway or not if you have stuck around and you know watched this entire video or somehow fast forwarded right to this part uh, you guys can all use the code Curtis Christmas 2020 on my Etsy shop at checkout in order to get 15% off your entire order. I figured that this would kind of be one of the other best ways to include everyone who was kind of interested in at least my products to get a little something off of their 
ordering. The code will be listed in the description below. Etsy automatically like capitalizes your code and everything, so you don't really have to worry about that. There's no minimum that you have to spend or any listings that are excluded, so just use the code and you'll get 15% off your entire order. Now that all that is out of the way, that is all that I have to say for today's video. I feel like I've been speaking a lot and I really didn't have that much to cover, um, but I did kind of miss you know sitting down and filming videos, and hopefully I can be making some more videos for you guys these next couple months as I will have a break off of college. If you guys want to check out any of the items on my shop, including the ones mentioned in today's video, as I've been saying throughout, you can just click on the link to my Etsy shop down in the description of today's video to check that out. And don't forget to use the code in order to get 15% off of your or um off of your order. That's it for today's guys. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you all in the next one.